All right, Koshi Chimes. Koshi Chime again. This one is fire. So if you have Koshi Chimes or looking to get some, in the center of the O is a color, and the red one relating to fire, but the color red also relating to root chakra, which is what we're going to do today. So some root chakra healing today. And today, any root chakra crystals, for example, we've got tourmaline, great for the root chakra, can be placed at the feet, can be placed anywhere really, or carrying tourmaline on your person to help repel any heavy energies from you, or to draw them out through the feet if you place them at your feet. We've got red jasper, red jasper does a lot of root chakra work as well, mookite. Aboriginal earthing stone, mukite, beautiful pieces. Hematite, that one's quite heavy. If you've got a hematite, you can feel the weight, so good for grounding, keeping you here. Picture jasper. So any crystal that's dark in colour can be used for root chakra. Red crystals, black crystals, brown crystals. Picture jasper is also good for plants. So at our place, you'll find some of these in the pot plants around the house, picture jasper. Jet. Jet crystals, they're really light. Um, they, you know, when I put them on students' hands, they're like, what? There's nothing there. But jet, great for psychic attack, but also grounding as well. Black obsidian. A lot of people do work with black obsidian. I've ne never really worked with it myself, but that's me, okay? So black obsidian is another piece that you could use. Um, smoky quartz. This one's one of the darker varieties of smoky but anyway whatever dark colored crystal that you might have if you want to use that in today's session for root chakra clearing so go and grab your crystal and then get into a comfortable position and i'll put symbols in your hands first and we'll get to work with the root chakra again okay but first of all we're not doing this all by ourselves we're doing this with reiki and our spirit teams and i want to add something else in here as well today okay but first let us connect so we can get the whole gang in and we're all here together so just closing down your eyes actually three deep breaths first okay breathing in release two more Just calm the farm. One more. All right, closing down the eyes and in your mind, repeat after me or call in God or the divine or the universe or whoever you work with, okay? For me, I call the light of universal love and healing to me. Call Archangel Michael to me for protection. Call my highest vibrational guides to me. Please help to move Reiki through me, not from me. And to me, me, me. For my highest will and good. Okay, but for me, I'm moving it through me connecting with you so can I please get you to put your hands up to the device now and I'm just going to put some Reiki symbols in there these are second degree symbols so trick ray trick ray trick ray say hey key say hey key say hey key trick ray trick ray trick ray and the distance symbol one shazi shonen one shazi shonen one shazi shonen which makes this all possible Gray, to gray, to gray, seal back in with the power symbol. Awesome. So, just feeling that there, the more you've been doing this with me, the more you should be able to start picking up on feeling this kind of energy for yourself. And we're going to take your hands, putting them over the root chakra. So, anywhere from the hips down to the tips of the toes. If you want to cover the whole area, just root chakra. So, maybe at the top part of the thighs. I've noticed over the years, root chakra has been moving down. And clients bodies okay but um wherever resonates best with you so just holding that position there while i'm sending energy through for your highest will and good so this is not me giving you energy this is reiki moving through me 
with the help of your team as well, connecting with you and Root Chakra. So get out of the way and let Reiki do what Reiki does, okay? It can see the bigger picture of everything that's going to unfold for your life. And we can't see that, okay? We came back with amnesia, go us, and here we are, <laughs> all right? So this is why Reiki is so good. It does things that we mightn't, you know, we mightn't know that there are things in there that might need healing. But Reiki can do all of this for us. Now, the other thing I wanted to add was... Because I've done this with clients over distance. Some people have rung in the past, for example, since we're at Root Chakra, saying, I need a new job. I've been looking and I just can't seem to get one. So with Root Chakra, if you've got any, any things that you want around, let's go with uh, money, job, work, career, study, living situations, you know, the roof over your head, so root chakra covers the shelter. So these are our basic survival needs. So if there's anything there that you feel that you would sincerely like, you know, not out of greed or anything, but out of help for yourself, like, like I was saying, for example, client, they needed another job. They lost their job and they were looking for another one. So what we did there is put in your mind now what it would feel like to have that job or that money or that living situation okay just closing down your eyes where your hands are over root chakra i'm still doing the work here but when you're doing this you're using you're tapping into mind and your team is watching okay we're so hooked up right now and just bring into mind what that would feel like for you. You know, feel it, sitting there, smiling, thinking, oh, shit, yeah, this is great. Getting into that energy of it because everything is energetic and vibration. And you're doing conscious work here. So you're playing with the energy of root chakra. Just focus for a moment. It gets exciting, it really does. <laughs> so building up that energy in mind, okay? Well, Reiki's doing what Reiki's doing. But you're also letting Source or God or the Divine or whatever you want to call it, letting it know what you'd like. You know, and using the mind to be living in the feeling of what it is that you would like, how you would feel if you had these things. Remember, we're just sticking with root chakra here, one step at a time. <laughs> and see what comes back, you know, over the next couple of days, weeks. Let me know what comes through. I'm going to add even more stuff here. Okay, so your hands are over root chakra. Let's just take them off now and give them a bit of a scoop. So scooping, one, flick it off, two, whew, yeah, three, and hands back over root chakra again. Okay. All right, so talking with my team now, talking with all of us here that are hooked up to source energy, to God energy, divine energy, the universal energy, whatever name we're giving this energy that we all are. And just asking, please, can you take a look at these people's thoughts, their desires, what they would love to have, and if it is for their highest will and good, can you please help them to align with this thing that they are wanting. Over the next hours, next days, next weeks ahead. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
Alright, cool. <laughs> I'd love to hear how this unfolds for you. <laughs> what comes about. Because, you know, when I did this with client, and this was over distance as well, it wasn't on a video or anything like this, they weren't following me. Um, it took, what, a week or so, and then they had a job. Another one took um, a couple of weeks, and then they had a new place because they were evicted and they needed to find a new place. So, you know, if, if you need to watch this again, go back and go in and go through the whole process again. But working the mind, you know, because you're an energetic being, using what we have access to, which is, oh, the feelings of the, the power behind mindset. Okay? And look, teeing that up with Reiki, what we're doing here now, and energy and your spirit team. Oh, man, this is like a massive triple whammy combo of energy going on here. So let me know how it goes. Have fun with it. You know, we're here to experiment. We're here to create. We're here to play. And that's exactly what we're doing right now in this video. Let's do three more scoops. Yeah, shaking hands off. Three scoops. One. Two more. One more. Nice. Alright, hands over the heart. I'm just going to seal all the sand for root chakra. Oh, I've got to put some master symbols on there, I'm being told. Cool. Alright, deep breath in. Release. Repeating after me, I now cut all energy cords associated with this session. Okay, cutting cords, taking your hands over the crown, third eye, throat, heart, solar plexus, sacral, root chakra, flicking it off, and over the back as best you can. And giving thanks to your team. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Awesome. So let that settle. Yeah, if you do get your job or your whatever it is you requested <laughs> during this session, send me a message. I'd love to know, okay? But in the meantime, Reiki's still working. Your team's still working on root chakra energies, which for the physical body is from the hips down to the tips of the toes. If it does get too much, just have a word to them. Guys, can you please back off for today? I need to function as a human and bring it back on again tonight while I go to sleep. Because sometimes spirit just gets so excited because they don't have a physical body. Like we've got to go through the motions, got to go through the day. So sometimes healing can be big, you know, in the way of triggers releasing, uh, menstrual cycle for the females, of course, with our root chakra energies, etc. Aches and pains um, coming up for release. But just feeling how this feels in your body. Drink plenty of water to help with energy flow. And I will be back. Well, actually, check on Friday. Um, when you're on the Facebook page, there'll be the Friday link dropping in, probably around 1 o'clock uh, Queensland, Australia time. And that will give you different ways of clearing the energy from the week gone by. There's videos in there of me just explaining different ways that you can do that for yourself. And on Monday, we'll be back again with an oracle card draw and protection symbols for the week ahead. Okay, But I've also put links in. Today is actually the last day that you can come and join us for our inner work workshops which starts on Friday. We've got Chakra Balancing Workshop on Friday from 10 till 4. It's a big day. There's only two spots left for that one, I think. On Saturday, we've got, oh gosh, Root Chakra, Sacral Chakra, Solar Plexus. And on Sunday, Heart, Throat, Third Eye and Crown. Okay, so it's a massive weekend. This is the only time I'm going to hold these events consecutively like this, three days in a row in Toowoomba in Queensland, Australia. But if you're not here, you can access all of these online workshops. There are video courses with the online link, which is also in the descriptions. But some people have asked, these dates don't work for me. They will be held in workshops throughout the year, maybe one 
a month, but that's about it, okay? And there will be um, retreats at some point, okay, for inner work stuff like this. I'm not sure about that one yet. I'm just doing what I'm told at the moment, okay? So I click on the links, check them out. There's also crystal care packs, which is a brand new thing. They can be posted to you anywhere Australia-wide only. Um, so if you're into crystals and want to receive a physical product along with some of the course material, take a look at the Crystal Care Packs Australia Wide Delivery. Anyway, guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed that. Oh, you're very welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. And yeah, let me know what happens. Okay, the money, the job, the living situation, root chakra stuff. Enjoy the rest of the week and enjoy the energy that you absolutely are.